Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin. This is our continuation of the Dark Souls trilogy, of course, it being, you know, the next one. I already played the first one. Um, I have a little warning here. Dark Souls 2 has not been remastered. So there's no UI scaling. Um, the graphics little, look a little dated. While I could add in some mods, because I am playing on PC, uh, some people have been vac banned for doing so. Seems kind of stupid, but I guess... I guess the software automatically looks for any modification of the files whatsoever, so I'm not going to be playing with mods because I don't want to get vac banned. I could just play offline, but part of the joy of Dark Souls is occasionally getting invaded, or looking at messages, or pretty much anything there. We could go in, and we are doing this pretty much blind. I have looked at a little bit into the builds, but the lore apparently no one knows what the fuck's going on, so we're going to be pretty much in the same boat there. Yeah, that's how it goes. If the music is a little loud, I apologize, but I can't actually adjust it from here. I did start a game briefly to see what the sound levels were like, but I can only adjust those inside the new game. I can't actually do that here. Let's just go ahead and jump in. There's going to be a cutscene. Might as well get what little pieces of lore we can. Long ago, in this Perhaps land. you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. A murky, forgotten land. Place where souls may mend your ailing mind. You will lose everything once branded the symbol of the curse, an augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. None will have meaning and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. Apparently that's kind of a bit downhill. Flame. Your 
our wings will burn in anguish. Time after time. For that is your fate. The fate of the cursed. Really shouldn't go head first into that, but I guess going feet first wouldn't be much better, so fuck it. Here we are. All right, so also looks like we're cursed. We have like half health. The UI is jai freaking enormous. Um, I can adjust a little bit of things here, but I don't know how much. Let's see, cinematic effects. I have no idea what the hell that means during attacks. Maybe that's fine. So the music's down quite a bit. Let's turn sound effects down a little bit. There, voice volume is going to be the loudest, but I think that's appropriate. Okay. I also realized that I turned on the death counter in the top left, but I didn't actually do anything with it, uh, meaning my program actually keep track of my deaths isn't there. So let me adjust that. You'll see my screen moving around quite a bit as it tracks my movement there. A little weird. Totally understand that. Okay. Select that. I'm going to test it. All right. That sure worked. So, that being said, let's uh, alt tab. Okay. Hey, the controls still work, so great. Already better than the remaster, gotta say. Oh, what we should do also is turn on the dynamic HUD, huh? Make it so we have a little bit of cinematic view here. So that's, um, just shut off. Where the hell is that at? Oh, target jump control is left stick. That's going to take some getting used to for sure. Uh, cross region play could do that. I don't know. Okay, I thought screen options. Here we go. Here we go. Change that to, yeah, hide automatically, please. We're going to, yeah, the brightness is probably fine. Yeah, the brightness is probably fine. I think you guys can see it on YouTube relatively well. Okay, the death counter is not hidden, which is good. So it looks like we're ready to go. Get it moving. We start with no weapons, nothing, in fact. Um, we could probably... Yeah, we can punch things if you wanted to. Hopefully we don't need to. The weird thing is, you can go... So, I know they've changed the way parry or post works now. Might not actually work at all. So, so much for that particular element of my repertoire. Be some things that I'm just gonna be reused to, I suppose. Hello, ladies. <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh my, your face. The face of the curse. It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. A beat You'll group, go I hollow. Yes. You'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. 
This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> <laughs> What is your name? I have no idea if my full name will fit here, so... Oh, I need to... There we go. Nope. Do the same thing we did for the first one, right? Interesting, it did an asterisk instead of an apostrophe. That's very strange, but sure. Are you kidding me? Okay, fine. That works. Are we just so you know what? Okay. Peace. That's it. Simple, direct, to the point. There you go. <laughs> At least you know your own name. Here's your reward for sharing. It's a human effigy. Is it? Is it really? Take a closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? The Wicker think Man? back deep into your past. Definitely the Wicker Man. Yes. It's an effigy of you. That's awfully specific. Okay, so now we make our character here. I have no idea. So we're gonna go strength intelligence, because that's the those are the two things we really didn't do in the last game. So that would be like Yeah, warrior Knight, maybe? Let's see, intelligence would be the the star, probably, right? Or would that be faith? Yeah, that's probably faith. Intelligence has got to be the book. It's got to be the book. The warrior starts with higher intelligence. Interesting. Uh, what about the swordsman? Also starts with higher. Six. I like six. There we go. Strength is probably the muscle. Nine. Oh, warrior starts way higher than that. Bandit. Not so good with intelligence, but if you were a really intelligent person, would you be a bandit? Probably not, right? But we start off as a cleric again. That's actually some really good balanced stats there. And we start off with heal. That'd be pretty good, actually. We start as a cleric again, maybe. Of course, it's a sorcerer, but the strength is super fucking low. We'll look at that. Three? No way. Explorer is reasonably balanced across the board there. There's a lot of various things. I don't know what the hell those things are, but a lot of them. Not sure about the monocle. Monocle? This is a monocle. And Deprive starts with nothing, but everything is balanced out. But you start at level 1. That's a little tempting. Yeah, why don't we go and go Deprived? It's going to take us a long time to level everything up. But we start at level one, and that'll be a little bit better. Nothing to fight with, though. I'm hoping we'll find at least something. I have no idea. It's a risk. It's a definite risk. But I like the balance stats. I'm going to do it. It might be stupid, but I'm going to do it. All right, so I was reading up on these gifts. Most of these are basically shit. Um, you can do something with this, I think. Petrified something. Um, inedible. I have no idea what this does. Healing wares. Your poison, restore HP. That's not a bad starting gift for a first playthrough, probably. Life ring. Not sure about... Oh, do we? can we do four rings this time? Two rings in each hand? What it looks like. That's actually kind of cool. Um, if that's true, let's go life ring. And we're already going to start off with some definite um, problems here, right? Okay, so then our body plays a woman. And let's see, I don't even know about the build types. Um, sure, I don't know. Fuck okay, it, any one of these. 
Any mini mini mo catch a tiger by the toe. When he hollers, let him go. Any mini mini mo. Guess what? It's you. <laughs> the first one. That's kind of funny. Okay. Zeke. Oh, we already did that, didn't we? I don't know. Fuck it by now. Okay. Base. So we'll start off with the homeland. Um. I don't know. Sure. Oh, if you're gonna go that, you might as well go this, right? And then hair color. Something wild like. That's a little bit too red. Can we do a little bit darker? There we go. There we go. Actually, the purple's kind of nice, too. Hmm. Let's go red. Go red. I know we can adjust everything here. Um, the eyebrows are fine. Just that. Eyebrow color. I mean, you shouldn't dye your eyebrows, but this is a fantasy world, right? We can totally do that. Eye color. Um, you're already blue. I, I like blues there. Tattoo. The hell does the tattoo go? Where's the tattoo at? And you change the color. Oh, it's on the face? Why would you tattoo your face? Why would you do this to yourself? We must be able to change the position. It must be changeable. I mean, let's first of all change the tattoo to something decent like this one. Tell not work. That's pretty good. Um, I'm guessing this is all... I'll relate to the tattoo. It's got to be in advanced settings. It's got to be. So overall, the hell? Age. Yeah, whatever. Hormones. No idea what the fuck that means, but okay. Form emphasis. I don't even know. Color emphasis. Weak and strong? Okay, that basically makes her darker. Whatever. Sure. There you go. But that's also skin color. So, blush or pale? Gotta be over the face. Yeah, there we go. Okay, see, so even out the face coloration a little bit. Whatever. Um, tattoo, there it is, the bottom. Okay, yeah, that's the tattoo, all right. Color, position, here we go, here we go. Okay, so I can move it. Okay, maybe I can move it down. Maybe I can move it down. Maybe that's what this is. Goes underneath her face. And I lost sight of it. Hold on. How is that even possible? How do you lose sight? What? Okay, hold on. That can't be right. Um, here, go this way. Does it only does it have to stay on the face? Is that the problem? I think it does. I think it has to stay on the face. That is super strange. Why would you put a tattoo on the face? Makes no goddamn sense. Okay, you know what, then? We're not gonna... I mean, I guess face tattoo, there it is, but we're not gonna do it. I and mean, that's just... It's weird, is what it is. Okay, you know what? She, she looks fine. She looks good. Let's let's leave it as is. Here we go. Here's our new strength build person thing we're gonna be doing. Um, we're done, right? So, how do we say we're done? Finish creation. There we go. Did we choose a gift? We did, right? Life ring, life ring. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. We're good. All people come here for the same reason. Do they? To break the curse. Ah. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Hey, now. Well, you never know. <laughs> 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 Encouraging group, aren't they? Go through the door and trot along to the kingdom. Trot? Excuse me? But remember, hold on to your souls. Well, yeah, name of the game, They're right? all that keep you from going hollow. Well, not just that. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> that's that's probably true. Can dispute. Cannot dispute. Okay, so she takes off her robes and reveals the character, right? Yep. Okay. Hello. I don't know why we had to look up at her like that. But that's okay. We have no weapons. Don't suppose there's anything upstairs you could lend me, maybe? Hot. Okay, 
Yeah, there's nothing. Oh, hey, there's a chest. You're not a mimic, are you? That'd be, that would suck to first start off. What do we got? Human effigy. I mean, that's still pretty good. Nothing else here, huh? Alright, well, so it goes. We talk to these nice people. How about we talk to this nice woman here? Hello. This is a limbo. A link between Drang Lake and the outer world. Fair traveler, I know that you must have a story. Why else would you visit such a place? This lost, decayed kingdom. My name is Millibeth. Hi, Millibeth. The old women were once fire keepers. I am here to look after them. It once? It is what my mother did, and her mother before her, and so on. So, where's your kid? Also, once fire keepers? I fire keepers couldn't leave their fire. Well, at least that's the way it used to be. So, from one piece to the other lore, I don't know if it's true or not, but what it seems to be is that it's assumed that in Dark Souls 1, you relink the fire, and this is the second go of it. Maybe. I don't know. I could be making shit up. I have no idea. The old women were keepers of the fire. Yes. But now, the fire shows signs of fading. And the kingdom is beset by hollows. Hmm. I don't know if I have actually the, uh... I set the ring here. Player status? What? Yeah, this ring's here. There you go. I didn't set that before. That's all set now. I can... Okay, interesting. I can back up like that. The old women are sisters. I am told there was a fourth. Long ago, fire keepers were commonplace. But now they are lost, scattered to the winds. Okay, so these are sisters. But not all fire keepers would be of the same family, right? Because that doesn't seem sustainable. The old women are long. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we're done with you. How about you? Got anything? <laughs> well, it's important to keep your sense of humor in your old age. That's it. Okay. Well, the joke's only funny once, right? Hello? You must go on a journey without rest. Well, I suppose if you find yourself at an arm pass. But if your will is yet unbroken, then you may return here. To start again with a clean slate. <laughs> so, was that meta about resetting the game and starting over? Or can I actually always come back here and, like, respec? The latter would be really interesting if that's true. Respec ability would be kind of nice. Okay, but anyway, hello. <laughs> uh, they're they're just really having a good time, aren't they? Probably at my expense. I think they said to go through this door, right? Okay, well, there's a fire here. Damn it. Bonfires are places to rest, but you may also light torches on them. Light torches on a bonfire. Interesting. Not done that before, but sure, we can go light this up. Funny you see you're trying to put away a weapon that doesn't really exist right now. Oh, right, I heard about that. So we can travel. Yeah, we can travel instantly. And we also have the bottomless box to begin with. Okay. I mean, I can't travel anywhere now because obviously I haven't seen anywhere else. All right, sure. Oh, something over here. Um, how do I get to it? I'm probably supposed to attack it. A little bit hardier than you expect, right? Now, oh, there you go. What do we got? Soul of the Lost Undead and a torch. Don't really want to use the torch right now, so we'll just keep going. Also, I noticed the HUD is not disappearing like I said it to. Right. 
tell you I only wanted your, you to show up? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. Hide automatically. There you go. There you go. Now that's more cinematic experience. Okay. Probably don't fall off the edges. Oh, are these arch trees? Uh, maybe. Maybe. A lot of fog walls. Do I go through the fog walls? I enter the mist. Sure. What could possibly go wrong? Because I don't have a weapon. Attack. Yeah, if I had a weapon, but anyway. There's a dude here. I can lock onto you. Okay, he's out. He did not drop a weapon. Alright. Target lock and release. Yeah, yeah, I figured that part out. Thank you. There's another dude here. Hello. Just a pugilist. Just didn't beat these guys to death. Finally, there was nobody here to change my target to. Okay, left stick and hold to dash. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Fortunately, these guys get stunned pretty damn easily. They're also not worth very many souls, but maybe as level 1, I don't need too much, right? Okay, what do you say? Oh, dash. I already did that. Okay, maybe I just got turned around. Uh, do, 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 do. Yep, this way. Okay, here we go. Oh. Uh, he's a big one. I'm not sure I want to punch him to death. Seems problematic. Don't need to yet, though. Read this. Um, I like to read it, though. Can I? Can you? Can you? There we go. Behind enemies back is critical hit every time. I guess that makes sense, right? I wonder what the critical hit is for bare, bare Okay. Apparently she knows jujitsu or something. Okay. Sure. I wonder if you could just do a pure melee build with your fist. I wonder if there's a good way to... Probably not, right? That's probably silly. Dagger. You know what? Any weapon's good. Let's just... Let's go ahead and equip that. There we go. Got ourselves a dagger. Huzzah! Now just for, you know, some armor and we'll be set. Roll. Okay. Same, same thing for rolling. That's good. Hello. Only I didn't see you there. I mean, I didn't, but the game saw you. I like the dissolve into ash. That's actually kind of awesome. Switch equipped weapon. I don't have anything, but okay. Yep, can totally do that. All right. It gets put away into nothingness, but you gotta expect that from video games, right? At this point, if you're surprised about that sort of thing, um, well, welcome to life. How interesting. You get to keep... Okay, so there's an item that stays on for a little bit longer. Interesting. Backstep. Yeah, I was noticing that. It's weird, but sure. There's a backstep. Oh, okay. So we're going to do this now, are we? Oh, okay, you got me, you got me. Oh, good hits. I'm out of endurance, though, so... There you go. Alright, so that was definitely meant to hurt us, right? Life gem. Oh, that's gotta be... That's gotta be the way we heal. Use item. Okay, so we need to... Inventory. Nope, this one. Okay, these are all items in our belt. I understand. Okay. Life gem there. Probably the human effigy? That turns us human, I think. Yes, yeah, item info. Here we go. Use item reverse hollowing. Also weakens the links to other world, preventing invasions and most cooperation. So wait a minute. You use this to stop invasions? 
That's interesting. I guess we're already human, right? We're human because they gave us an effigy, I would think. What is this? Oh, loose souls return. Okay, yeah, yeah. We've never used that before. Used to acquire souls. Banish phantoms return to your world. Sure, we'll go ahead and set that. And this is Bone of Order. Restores the link to other worlds. Honestly, couldn't tell you. So, sure. Okay, so we can heal ourselves. I'm gonna wait on that just for now. Move camera. Yep, I've already figured that out. If you've gotten this far without knowing how to move the camera, that must be incredibly frustrating. Um, the help. Give it smooth. Yes, you! Give us Silky! I don't think I have anything to give you guys, do I? No, uh, we have a... Oh, interesting. We still have that equipment there. You know what? We should probably at least wear it. I mean, it's not what they're asking for at all, but... Yeah, okay. I mean, it doesn't offer much in the way of protection, but it offers something. Maybe not the helmet thing, because I like her hair. So get rid of that. Um, can I remove? There you go. Yeah, because her hair is kind of awesome, right? So, sorry guys, don't have anything for you. How do I get the ladder here? X? Oh, okay, there we go. Ah. If I get if I find anything, guys, I will try to remember to come back to you. The same way? Pull down B, you know? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's different now. It's B and hold down. That's tricky as fuck. Why would you change it? Come on, guys. What are you doing? Okay, no, that's back the way we came. I wonder if we have to beat him up. It seems to be leading that way. Okay, can I... Yep, more fog wall stuff. Alright, sure. Statue blocks your way. Can't beat up the statue. Yep, I can't get past the statue. Alright, there must be something we can do later then. Interesting they would do that now. He looks like a petrified guy. I don't know. Weird. Sure, we'll go this way. What the hell? Whole lot of nothing going on. Oh, read message. Sure. Be wary of man, therefore try a woman. What? Okay. I mean, I am trying a woman, I guess. Be wary of message. Like, which one? Also, bloodstains. How the hell do people die here? There must be an enemy ahead. So he's just standing there. And then, yeah, he dies. How the hell did you die? Who'd you die to? Bloodstain. Yeah, you're right. That's a bloodstain, alright. Ghost? I don't know, dude. You tell me. A lot of people trying to stab things and then dropping to their doom. Okay. Um, what the hell did they die to, though? Head required a head. If you don't have a head, what are you doing? Message? Praise the sun or give it up. Okay, apparently there's a lot more freedom in creating messages this time. We don't have the orange soapstone, though, do we? Do we? Not yet. Light ahead, then hurrah for sorcery. Okay, sure, if you say so, buddy. Raise the sun. There's sun outside. We're off for bright spot. All right, sure. Another blood spot. How did you die? Attacking somebody behind you. And getting totally wrecked. So is somebody going to sneak up on us when we get past here? Azula. Amulgata. Um, I don't see anybody. I don't know what the hell they died to. You jump off the edge, probably. There's nothing stopping you, apparently. Okay. Gorgeous here. Very pretty. Lighthouse over there. I'm sure bad guys are going to jump out anytime now. Well, especially the fact that there's a blood stain here. Is there, like, something horrible? Gonna be... Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm lost already. Hold on. Yeah, so that's where we came out of. 
looks like there's a secondary path over here. Also something to pick up over this way. I see you. What's this? Divine Blessing. I have no idea what the hell that is. Look at our inventory. Uh, there it is. For fully restores HP, cures all status effects. Okay. Cool. Don't need it yet, but maybe eventually. So what is this? Probably where everyone died. Weakness backstepping. Good to know. Thank you. We're probably going to die here. Praise the sun, if you say so. Weakness is backstepping. Probably also dodging. Can dodge. Yeah, there's probably lots of bad guys here. Careful. Don't see anybody, though. Pathway right over here. Can't really see much. Alright, so this is probably where they got killed. I'm a little puzzled where's the where they died. Looks like they got shot or something. This looks like they got shot. Key ahead. Key to what though? Don't give up. Alright, you know what? Can I rate that? Thank you. I don't think that actually rated it. Okay, yeah, I can't rate it again. So rate just means up. That's it. You just can rate it up. That's it. You no know rating down. There's probably bad guys, but I don't know. Oh, yeah, there's a dude right there. There is a dude right there. Um, I have no idea if we want to do this yet. I don't have a proper weapon, but he looks like he might have a proper weapon on him. So whether or not he drops is nothing entirely. I thought there was a dude. Not a dude? Oh, it is a dude. Totally a dude. That actually looks like an awesome sword. Would he like to talk, maybe? Can we talk to him? Ally ahead. Okay, so we can talk to him. Let me grab this item first. Life jam, Howard Bone. All right. Hello, man. Can I talk to you? There you go. Have you business with me? The um, way you're under is all blocked up, you see, by this god awful statue. Heavens above. Who thought it a good idea to pit it there? Oof. I'm in quite the pickle now. White the accent. Everything else say to me? See that statue? Gives me the willies. You stare at it for long enough, it starts to look alive. Ah, it just doesn't he seem quite right. There are no craftsmen round these parts. Hey, you don't think a real life person was turned to stone, do you? I mean, these parts, who knows, right? Maybe. See that statue? Okay, you already said this. Thank you. Um, so, there's a lot of bloodstains. Did they try to kill this nice man? Why would you kill him? Why would you kill him? That there's a bad guy over here? Oh, what the fuck? Okay, he has a lot of health. He has a lot of health. Hit the life gem. He has a lot of health. Okay, restore the endurance. We can get this guy down. My dagger could just suck, though. The endurance. What the hell item is that? That must be a poison staff or something. Almost got him. Almost got him. What the hell? I mean, he died, so that's good at least. Uh, there's another one. There must be. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Hello. Oh shit. Oh shit. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. I can't go. Oh no. Oh no. 
No! Give me out, give me out, give me out, give me out. Um, I'm in the wrong place. That is not out. I don't know if you know that, but I died. Okay. We got fucking ambush. I think... I think the explosion alerted them. Oh, we started all the way back here. That does kind of make sense. And look at that. We are so dead. Okay. Well, that's fine. We should have gone probably towards the lighthouse. Oh, interesting. There's a... Did we not go this way? What does this do? More tutorialization. Wield right weapon two-handed. Oh, yeah, I forgot you do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, doing it with a dagger is kind of weird, but... Okay. Hello. We use more endurance, but it does do more damage. Okay, maybe we'll get a better weapon than a dagger. That'd be nice. Eventually. Do so. Hello. While dashing, dashing jumps. You need to press. And that seems tough, but okay. Hold on. Get out of my way. There we go. So run. Oh, it did work. It did work. I didn't die. Amber herb? What the hell? Amber herb. Slightly restores spell uses. Slightly, huh? I wonder if we would just die. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know how hydrophobic our character is here or how deep that water is, but it can't be good for us. Okay, that's a little bit finicky, but I can get around it. So is that it? Just to teach us how to jump? Okay, I can get behind that, I guess. The jumping's a little bit weird, though. Right, can't get to him because there's a statue in the way. Not the statue the other guy was talking about, though. There must be another one. And you could probably light those tor- Oh, you light the torches and that gets the, the thing out of the way, right? Maybe? Yeah, maybe. It depends on how long the torch lasts, but I could see that. I could see that. Like, you light this torch and maybe that was the statue. Not that I want to fight the big guy, though. Not yet. We need to find a sword first. Before we even think about doing that. But that's something we can consider coming back to. But it might be a puzzle type thing. And the statue moves out of the way. It's my guess. I don't know. Maybe something else will happen entirely. Okay, this I don't get, though. Why are there so many freaking bloodstains? How do you die here? Maybe the big guy, they like let him down the corridor, but why would you do that? You need like plenty of open space about a big guy like that. Or it could be the game developers fucking with me. That's also true. It could happen. Alright, so we'll go this way, because we didn't go this way before. Oh, there's the lighthouse. And that's another fire. Oh, this might actually be a easier to go through to come back from. Okay. Bonfire lit. Can I... There we go. Rest. Oh. I can't level up at a fire? What? That doesn't make any damn sense. The fire over here. This is not where I came from, but... We should read the message, I suppose. Don't you dare. It's actually a bad way to go. I have no idea. This could be really bad for us. It said, don't you dare. Item, maybe. Yeah, okay. Really heavy, apparently. Rusted coin. No idea. Temporarily boost luck. Like consumable, or do I equip it, or what? Okay, you can change weapons to a lot of different configurations, apparently. I guess we put this on it? I don't know. Wait a minute, that seemed to have a timer? Five minutes. 
the hell is the five minutes for? Or five... Yeah, it's gotta be five minutes, right? The hell? Mimicry? No, it's not. You're okay. Not a mimic. Also, where the hell did you get the orange soapstone? Because I don't seem to have one. Composure ahead. You say so, bud. Try left. Kill me immediately? Is that what's happening here? No? Nothing to... Oh, okay. Sure. Whoever said try left, get ready to have my son. Um, though it didn't seem to do much. Tough enemy ahead. Try left, nimble one. Or did it open up this door? Oh, it's probably timed. Maybe? Maybe not. Okay, now you're supposed to roll under it? That seems like a fucking trap. That seems like a fucking trap. Okay, well... Figure this out for next time. In the meantime, thank you for watching. This has been Dark Souls 2. I'm Peace of the Universe. You're Peace of the Universe 2. I'll see you guys next time.